Um, I'd like to ask you why is it so important to improve the European Citizens Initiative and why is the Parliament uh, calling, why will it call for a reform of the ECI? But simply because the ECI uh, didn't work, there was an enormous effort and enormous enthusiasm in people who signed, who, who created, uh, uh, invented initiatives, but uh, only three uh, initiatives were successful and none of them has had a follow-up from the Commission. So the situation is dramatic. I think the ECI without a reform is dead. And we are creating distance and people in Europe, rightly I think, uh, mm, f uh, feel very often that the European institutions are distant and sometimes arrogant. And I think we should uh, we should uh, break this uh, wall. And what will the Parliament do to really make the, to pressure the Commission to change the regulation on, on the ECI? How the, we have to receive the response from the Commission. So we are asking the Commission to start this revision to change um, a good number of, of things inside the, the Citizens' Initiative and we will give us uh, enough time, but which is not too much. I, I will say that in the coming six months we will be following up that, very especially from the, uh, the petitions committee. Uh, this will not be the last step in the ECI reform because we need a change in the regulation. Yes. And this can only be uh, tabled by the Commission. Uh, what will you do to pressure the Commission to do this? Now, first of all, I have brought in amendments for a change of regulation because that was not clear. We were talking about for a long time about improvements, but not clear, uh, didn't uh, call clearly for change of the regulation. That's in the text now. So this is a help helpful addition, uh, these 76,000 signatures. So I think the Commission is ready to move. It's just a question occasionally of helping them to move in the right direction, which I hope will be ready next year sometime. Well, the Parliament has today uh, made an important step towards the demands of the citizens, but unfortunately some of the further reaching reforms were not adopted. Anyway, the struggle for a true participatory European democracy is something we cannot win in one or two days. It will be a long-run struggle with the NGOs and uh, we have to succeed to make Europe closer to the citizens. And soprattutto in una, in una maggiore democrazia diretta in Europa. Más democracia para Europa. Ich bin für mehr Demokratie in Europa. Mis democracia para Europa. Mehr Demokratie auch in Europa. Mehr Demokratie in Europa.